Hey guys, welcome back. So today I have for you my five transitional pieces summer to autumn. What this basically is, is I bought some items. When I mean items, I mean there's clothes and some accessories that I'm rocking right now in summer, but actually they're gonna go all the way to fall. So let's start. Okay, so let's start with piece number five. Now before it, four from these pieces are from Zara um, and uh, I know that I typically go there, but I feel like if you're looking for designer inspiring pieces i mean like sarah is the way to go i know that there's a lot of controversial topics about it but right now i cannot afford a chanel tweet blazer so of course i'm gonna go to sarah because i mean it's the second best thing that i can find so yep so of course as you guys know patchwork is gonna be huge in fall so i knew that sarah's gonna bring their pieces and when i saw this dress i just felt in love with it if i can find the beginning here it is and I mean, I know that the color scream fall, but you might be asking, okay, Steph, how you can work this in summer easy? Um, basically, right now, I just pair this up with a pair of a flat sandals and, of course, one of my straw bags, and it works perfect. And I feel it's because of the fact that the material of this dress is really breathable i mean it's really lightweight so of course um it's not gonna be too hot in it and i feel like the fact that it has buttons all the way from the top to the bottom um you can uh obviously um loose them up show a bit of leg um and also i kind of love the neckline as well because it's quite low so it's perfect um to layer it up necklaces now if you're asking me how i'm gonna wrap this in fall simple uh just with a pair of ankle boots and of course a leather false jacket i feel like it's gonna look perfect um but yes i'm happy with it i am experimenting a bit with color here um but i feel like this is gonna be such a great layering piece when the uh, colder times comes but yes this is my first in a way summer to autumn piece now the other one that i got this one should be number four is a pair of black pants i know this seems boring guys but what I kind of love that I am seeing now how they're signing up these tuxedo pants and I'm really feeling it. I mean, at first I thought they were always great for the working girl, but I feel like there's so much better ways that you can rock this that I knew that I needed a pair. Again, they're from Zara, um, but I love that they have pockets. I love the bag and I also love the fact that they're a bit cropped. So perfect if you're wearing heels or sandals because they're not going to cover your whole feet. And I also love the fact that they're really comfortable. I mean, they're perfect to go and meet a buffet with it because they're not going to restrict you as much as denim do. Um, if you're asking me how I can wear this in summer right now, of course, I'm going to wear it with some sandals, maybe with a t-shirt uh, with a little bit of a knot, and of course, with one of my straw bags, and it works perfect. Now, if we're talking about going out, of course, the can work great with a v-neck sweater or a chunky knit um with a jacket on top and of course with a pair of heels but i love it um i do want to get maybe like a more uh lighter shade for example like an off-white i feel like it could work great but yes i feel like i don't know i love that they give a little bit of I don't know like men chicness to a look and yes and I'm all about comfort so happy 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 that I got this one from Sara. now the third piece that I added into my wardrobe is a top now this is not I mean obviously tops can work all year around but what I kind of love about this one for the beginning of fall is the fact of the material I mean it feels a little bit like tweed I mean of course it isn't but it is an inspired piece and again it's from Sara. I kind of love that it's more like a slogan tee it says not a cliche which I think is really cute but I think what it really gets me into this working right now in summer is the fact that it's crop um, so of course I'm gonna wear this with my Levi's 501s or maybe with my girlfriend denim I feel like with denim this can look so good as well with a pair of those black pants but um, I'm really feeling the sleeve they're a bit long and also the material even though that it feels a little bit thick again I feel like it's breathable obviously the fact that it's crop makes it a little bit more summer appropriate but again I feel like tweed for me is fall and winter so I kind of love that this is giving me the vibe to get a tweed blazer once the obviously um, the weather starts to drop but yep happy with it now we're missing the other two and now the other two are accessories to me 
I'm all about accessories. It's where I typically like to invest a little more money. Um, so when the time has come for shoes, I think this can be controversial because maybe when winter comes, you're not gonna think about wearing lace up heel sandals because you're probably gonna say, isn't that best for summer? But again, guys, I do live on a warm weather so I can wear this all year around. So I'm talking about a pair of Ray. Now, if you don't know Ray, they sell in Revolt. They're one of my favorite shoe brands and of course I needed to get my hands on one of this one I haven't seen them on Amazon so many times um, that I knew that I wanted them um, I was between this one and a pair from Free People but the Free People ones are full leather so I feel that they would be maybe a little bit uncomfortable while these ones are more suede again I feel like suede is perfect for the beginning of fall um, now I feel like I love them because they make your legs really sexy I love the fact that the heel isn't too high so of course they're gonna be comfortable for the everyday they were a little bit pricey though they were 168 but again I feel like I like to invest more in a shoe that I know that I'm gonna wear a lot instead of just buying pairs that are gonna slip on my closet so yes really happy that I got this one from Ray and now the fifth piece you know that it's going to be a bag if you follow me you have seen it plenty of times or if you do follow my blog you know that I spoke that this was the first piece that I wanted to get and I'm talking about the beauty bag you know you're gonna see it a lot in fall so of course I went to Zara to get uh, a piece of one of those now this one what I kind of love I mean first thing first is black you know that I love my monochromatic but I feel like when I look at it it looks like a piece of art um, definitely has some weight in which I feel like it makes it look a little bit more spencier and the fact that it's quite spacious um, I'm really feeling it now I think it comes also like in a fuchsia color but of course I was gonna get the black um, mango does a lot of them so of course you want to find different styles I highly recommend them um, but of course I feel like everyone has the eye on the shrimp one which I'm gonna try to put a picture on it that one is amazing. I feel it's like a, almost like a pearly white, but of course it's a designer piece. Just know it's gonna be over five hundred dollars. No thanks. I feel like because this is such a trendy piece, obviously I want to go first a little more affordable brands. And if I maybe the cost of wear uh, gets in it, I might think of buying a designer one. But for right now, I'm really happy with this one from Zara. Well guys, this is it. I hope you enjoyed this video. So please let me know what are your transitional pieces from summer to autumn or maybe what is your one piece to get. I sure want to know what you're thinking about. So of course, if you want to get any of these items, everything is going to be linked below as well as my social media. And if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel, there's also is the link below. So yeah guys, this is it. I'll see you next time with a brand new video. Bye!